The torque converter is the launching device of the Allison fully automatic transmission, constituted by two main halves, pump and turbine, that uses fluid to launch the vehicle, instead of a traditional dry clutch used in manual or automated manual gearboxes. At ignition, as the engine flywheel rotates and the converter pump rotates with it, pressurized fluid is drawn from the transmission sump into the converter cavity. Centrifugal force causes the fluid to be thrown out from the pump onto the veins of the turbine. As the fluid comes back off the bottom of the turbine blades, it strikes the front face of the stator blades, which redirects the fluid back towards the pump at an accelerated rate. As this cycle is repeated, the fluid gains an extra push and the rotational force is multiplied, enabling the turbine to transfer up to twice the full engine torque to the driveline. As the turbine increases speed and approaches the speed of the pump, lockup is engaged for solid mechanical connection between the two halves. This principle of operation means that the torque converter has the following unique values. No wear, because the torque converter uses fluid to couple engine and driveline at vehicle launch or during low speed maneuvering. Unlike a slipping clutch that does wear and requires replacement over time. Shock absorption, fluid coupling and torsional damping absorb shocks, typical at vehicle launch or during maneuvering. High torque. It allows the use of high engine torque at vehicle launch, whilst a slip-in clutch cannot unleash it, as it would overheat or burn up. Torque multiplication. Torque converter has a multiplication ratio and multiplies engine torque by that ratio during the vehicle launch. In general, an Allison can multiply up to twice engine torque at launch. Lockup. A torque converter operates hydraulically only when needed. Lockup is early engaged to transmit engine power efficiently and fuel economically. To summarize, the torque converter in an Allison Automatic provides superior launch, better acceleration, higher average speed, lower maintenance cost and ease of operation.